Morning everyone. Welcome to another edition of Bushcraft Outback. This week I'm going to be promoing a Coleman French military tent that I had bought about a year ago. Never had it out of the box. I just liked it when I saw it and uh, this weekend my grandson and I were going to do some truck camping in the backyard and the weather was just hot and humid and I decided let's break this thing out. It's got some features on it that I thought would come in handy and it did. So we're going to walk around this thing. I'm going to show you outside. And I'm going to show you inside. This was about a $65 tent, and uh, uh, it is worth every penny. And I don't normally do uh, promotionals on tents, but if you find something that works this well, you got to let people know about it. So uh, let's walk around this thing, and I'll show you what it's all about outside and inside. Stay with me. Now I put some high visibility lines on this tent in my backyard because I just didn't want my grandson to trip over it in the middle of the night. But it does come with all the bells and whistles. I love these little tie outs. They're very authentic. And I'm not sure if this particular tent is a replica or if it is actual unused uh, military style. Uh, but Look at the vestibule over this, and there is a vent in the very top of this up here. And there is actually four vents. There's two on each end and two down at the bottom, which I'll show you inside. And this thing worked out fantastic. I loved everything about it. It comes with uh, tie outs on the outside, and it rained. As you can see, there's moisture on this thing. It rained, but these little flaps, these storm flaps, actually stuck out and uh, we stayed high and dry. I had, uh, and it's it's actually doesn't look that big when you look at the tent from either side. My daughter-in-law said, well, where is he going to sleep? Uh, is that just for him? And I said, no, you'd be surprised. It's an 80 by 60 floor. And uh, I actually, it comes with some extra poles, which I'll show you in a minute. But I actually use my uh, ski stakes for my walking sticks on there just for support, but uh, it comes with some authentic stakes. I'll show you that in a minute. Okay, a couple of things I wanted to show you. Here's that authentic pole that actually comes with this that you can use, but I actually used my walking sticks and they worked out rather well too. I think I like them better. I'm sure you can modify this, but these come with the, with the tent to break down their lightweight and uh, work, work really, really well. But I want you to check out these tent stakes. Now, you know, if you've bought tents, you see these tent stakes, they are actually very, very beefy, and I was impressed with them as well. So, uh, yeah, another nice feature. Hey, let's go inside, and I'll show you how roomy this thing is. And uh, I don't know if you've noticed that this is a one-piece tent, so it doesn't have to put the bottom out and the top on. It's all one piece, very easy to set up. The zippers are very high caliber zippers as well. But this thing actually comes, and it is pretty roomy on the inside here. I had a full cot, and it had an air mattress. We, had a, we ran a little fan when we started off because it was very, very humid. But you can see it is pretty roomy on the inside, and... Um, I was just impressed with the room. Uh, it's very deceiving that it had this much room in it. As you can see, there is another vent in the top of this and it vents very, very well. Uh, the general construction of this is just very impressive. So if you look down here, there's actually vents along the side that are Velcroed. And uh, when you open them up, you've got vents along here and on my side of the bed, you actually had a vent that ran all along there, same Velcro, but the temperature last night was kind of balmy, but when the winds kept blowing, uh, it actually got kind of chilly in here. It was about 68 degrees and we slept well. Yes, yeah, so look this tent up on Amazon, made by Coleman, and it's called the French Military Army Pup Style Tent. Highly recommended. I think we paid, like I said, 65 bucks or something like that for it. 
the construction of this is very, very impressive compared to the tents that you see today. And it worked, it rained last night. Um, well, it's rained for a couple of days, but it's everything stayed high and dry and inside. So uh, I'm very, very impressed with it. So I did this video for a couple of reasons. One, to show you uh, a nice priced tent that's well worth the money. But also I pitched it in my backyard, camped with my grandson, and he really didn't care whether I was in the Great Smoky Mountains or in my backyard. He just wanted to camp out. So whether you're off the beaten path or right in your backyard, get out there and enjoy what nature brings and make sure you keep God first.